Hello from upriver just a little bit. A bear river. I saw something on the surface there making little rings, so I came up, but it left. So uh, there's fish here, and you can see that there's some rocks, but yeah, there's a lot of sediment, um, you know, clayish kind of silty stuff. And that's what they said. Oh, there's too much silt. You can't make their nests. Well, that's all a choice. It's all a choice that we make. Except there's not enough flow. Well, that's a choice. We need to remember those things. They're choices that we make in our management decisions. They're not excuses. They're choices. And they're not reasons. They're choices. So, if that big fish made it all the way there, then maybe some could make it up here. I guess um, there's records of them making it all the way to that dam just below Camp Far West. They got one for the canals to fill up their canals. And they didn't, for some reason, they didn't have to build fish passage which they should. They didn't make them do it. They just, they got this raise their dam thing at Camp Far West. They don't gotta do fish passage. Why not? The salmon are going extinct. We need to take action. The status quo and let things go is the way to destroy everything. We need to change course. It's a choice. Fish passage, restoring the river. Come on, river partners. Bear River is calling you. You did two miles, come do the rest. When they did it, they go, oh, it's for floods. They didn't say it's for restoration, but I guess they have to say that in order to get the money flowing. Because money to bring life and restore a river, it's harder to get than money to protect people's homes. Just like those wildlife crossings on the freeway. Not because of the wildlife and that they will live, but it's doing damage to cars, don't you know? And that's why they do the wildlife crossings. Upside down world. But there's beauty all around us. And there's a lot of birds up here, I've noticed. It's one of the differences from here to that other Highway 70. Okay, the Niwachone. This river is still trying to bring life in spite of everything that's happened. We're moving forward in a good way, Maniwachone. Water is life. Rivers are life. Bear River will live.